Kanchi Purem Ganalan was born in India in 1957. He grew up in a small, loving family and had a carefree childhood. As a child, Guna's family designed and built their family home. Guna spent a lot of time at the construction site. He was mesmerized by the entire process. His father was the planner and his mom was the site supervisor. All of this activity was absorbed by young Guna. The planning, materials, labor, workmanship, and engineering that was involved. One of his uncles even said, I think Guna is going to be an engineer. He was right. As a young man, Guna visited his brother, who is 14 years his senior, in England. His brother has played a big role in his career path. It was there that he realized he needed to travel to new places and explore his options. Back in India, he fell in love and got married to his wife, Duru. In 1982, he and Duru moved to the United States. His work ethic stems from watching his father, brother, and mother. He was taught to get up every day and try to make a difference. He also teaches this concept to his own children, Kabilar and Pallavi. I'm very proud of my dad, and I love that people are able to see him as a leader. He's always been a leader to me, um, partially because he's ever-evolving and accepting of so many different types of people, and he's so invested in everyone's education and improvement. Growing up, my dad always put me in the right position um, at the right time to help maximize my potential. He got me into Boy Scouts. He helped get me into the, the best high school in the, in the city. And he really helped foster uh, my love for a, n a number of different uh, passions. And I know that he would do the same for the younger uh, members of ASC. I hope that one day I'll be able to give back as a mentor like he has to me. He loves making a difference through what he does professionally. I've had the f good fortune of working with Guna on some, some very large, complicated projects. And uh, when you have the experience level of someone like Guna has, uh, he makes it look easy. Of course, he's focused on delivery of a project. He was really thinking about the mentoring of the people working on the project sharing ideas about what success looks like, and creating a lasting legacy for the profession. He makes use of every opportunity to learn and contribute. He's a guy that when he calls and he has to do something, it's very hard to say no, because he can make the case for the public good, and he, you know he's working harder than you are. So he asked me to help organize a session at an ASC conference on resilience. And uh, as, as with other issues in sustainability and in education, he's thinking ahead and really helping to influence the whole society. He currently lives in Utah, which he says is not too different than life in India. He has made very good decisions, including the move to Utah. Utah is home, has been a good place to raise our children. He has always been there for them, and he has been supportive of their activities. Guna believes that being involved in your community is vital, passing on a better world than we inherited. Today, Guna is Senior Vice President for Transportation, Alternative Delivery for the Americas at AECOM. His, his attitude towards developing younger staff and, and advancing these projects in a much more collaborative fashion is what really sets him apart. We're delighted that one of our own Guna is going to be uh, the president. So, you know, great kudos to him. It's a great organization. We know he'll do a, a fantastic job, and we're really looking forward to building the relationship with ASC and, uh, and doing everything we can do to make this a great year. Congratulations to Kanchipuram N. Gunalan, the American Society of Civil Engineers 2020 president.